every morning I wake up and look outside hoping that I can wear shorts and every day it's a ha ha nope and then I put on pants. Um, a day there's a little bit of blue maybe maybe it's gonna be an interesting day today I woke up early my hair is doing weird things so I'm gonna fix that before I go anywhere um, but yeah I was up at quarter to eight and normally I wake up at like 10 to 8 and then roll out of bed at 5 to 8 so I've got a lot of extra time which is why my hair is done mostly apparently I need to fix that and um, yeah the girl that normally does the dock in the morning, the girl that used to be my morning buddy before they changed the hours is away doing taxi charters for most of the day. So the other girl has to work, so I guess she'll be closed. Yeah, it's going to be an interesting day today, but the boss is coming, well, one of the bosses is coming back to the bosses, technically, I guess, um, after they do the giant town list shop. It's like, we need this, and we need this, and we need this, and we need this, and we need this. It was, it was a lot of stuff, but yeah, that's exciting i don't know i'm just rambling now i'm just waking up and my battery's about to die so i'll check in with you at some other point well hello i'm in a new place i'm in strudel's mom's cabin right now Woo, so nice um there's i don't know i didn't mention it earlier so there's no adults on property well i mean um there's one person on property but she usually does stuff with like the restaurants so not so much with the answering of phones and stuff so it's pretty much me on answering phones um, and then the other girl who has one year more seniority of me is out on the water taxis. I think she should be back by now though, but so it's it's been a hectic day. Um, I Got down to the store and I got down to the store and the other dock attendant had just taken a call for a water taxi And she's like, oh, I'm not sure if we can do this and I'm like, yeah, I think we can do this here Thankfully strudel's mom is on a first aid hold today So I was able to email her right away and check and so we're all good But then I had to like run over to the other house to get on the long-range radio And then come back and then everybody was checking out at once and the cabin was checking out and blah 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 And it was so hectic. I went like non-stop for an hour and a half, which was okay, but it was busy and then I find like things kind of start to settle down. So it's quarter to one, I'm on my break now, but I'm up in this house because there's a phone in here. So if the phone rings and there's water taxi stuff, I can sort it out from here because out of the people that are on, because I, like I said, I don't think the other skipper's back. She might be, but she's bringing in boats on the dock if she is, so she probably won't be near the phone. So the people near the phone, they'll be answering the phone. I'm the most qualified, I guess to do the water taxi stuff because I did a lot of it in November and so yeah I'm just trying to stay near a phone so I can answer it if need be so I think it's slowed down a bit now though we pretty like people are like can we get propane and I'm like I'm sorry you're going to have to wait several hours because everybody who does propane is off property right now we have water taxi ride eh, not until about two o'clock so yeah it's been pretty hectic but we're doing all right I have spaghetti for dinner lunch lunch here and um, I'm just getting some work done, hopefully. Should be, should be good. There's um, not too, too much going on, just boats coming in, so it should be okay. The phone seemed to have calmed down a bit, so that's nice, because there was a moment there where it was just go, go, go. And the last phone call I took, I like went to like kneel down to do something, and I had to like get up and run, so yeah. Anyway, I'm just updating. I am starving though, so I'm gonna continue eating food, and um, yeah. Alrighty, so I have finished lunch. There was some oh, phone. Oh right, <laughs> I'm back. I had to run and get the phone. Um, yeah, there was like it wasn't a distress call. Um, oh my god, the phone. I'm almost afraid to start vlogging again because the last two times the camera, the the phone has rang that I've turned on the camera. Anyways, it's about ten to two, so I'm back at two. Uh, oh, there goes Strudel. Anyway, like I was saying, it's really interesting because Strudel's mom has a radio in here because she's always answering radio calls and stuff. And um, there was, it wasn't a distress, it was somebody, a boat spotted another boat launching two red flares. And so they were like, called it in, they're going to investigate. And then it's just like, well, where are you? Well, what type of boat are you? What type of boat are they? Is anybody in distress? And blah, 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 blah. They just went on forever. And then finally they're like, anybody in the area can give us an update. And then my boss, who's out on the water, called. And he's like, because it was saying that it was in blind channel. But 
when asked to clarify, they said that they were in Johnstone Strait, which is near here. And um, so he's like, is it just going on in front of my channel? I was like, no, this is what it is, like, blah, 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 blah. And so, yeah, so that was good. But then, yeah, phone call, phone call, phone call. And then um, we have my other bosses are coming back in to back in from town today because they were away for a couple days and nobody could get a hold of the person that's supposed to pick them up and so I tried radioing and it didn't work and I tried calling and it didn't work and so finally I like text it and I was like I hope this goes through and it did so that's awesome I also put it into the calendar so like even if he didn't hear it at least he would see it um but yeah so I'm almost done here <sighs> it's been busy it's been good. Also, when I texted or emailed Strudel's mom to be like, I'm in your house! And she's like, well, clean it while you're there. And I was like, well, I made a mess of the table, so we have to clean that. But I swept for her and I did her dishes because she works so hard. She's out on the water, like, for like 12 hours every day kind of things. And plus, then she answers the phone while she's here and she does social media and blah, 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 blah. So, yeah. So it'll be a nice little treat for her to come home to. Plus, I have to come back and get my bowl and my fork because I'm leaving them here. But I'm gonna go fill up my water now and then pack up my stuff and head down to work, I guess. Today has continued to be a day, but it's just about done now, which is great. It's like quarter after six. Bosses are all back, which is nice. We had so much stuff to go over when they first got here because just so much has been happening. And everybody was offline today, like I said, but we're good now, so that's Flying nice. See, it just, it doesn't stop, but it's at least a little bit more chill. I'm feeling better now, because yeah, there was just so much stuff and the, they left me in charge. It's fine, anyways. I should be out, getting out of here soon, which is nice, because I really need to pee, but there is no way to cover me, but whatever. <laughs> Alrighty, it is the end of the night now. It's like 11 o'clock, everybody came over. Our house became the house of refugees because um, I don't know if I mentioned it earlier, but the one of the cooks quit and so nobody wanted to be around So everybody just kind of came up and hung out here tonight because I think they're leaving tomorrow the the cook so yeah That's fun That'll be something to deal with but you know, it's all good um, I forgot that today was Tuesday because it was so busy and that today is Wednesday and mail day and so I didn't edit all my vlogs so it's fine I'll just send them out on Friday I guess um yeah too late to do anything now but with that I'm going to say thank you so much for coming along on today's adventure and I'll see you tomorrow when hopefully it's not as busy but we do do similar things <laughs> good night <laughs>